Hello everyone, this is a step-by-step -step video on how to purchase Tribit. This is no financial advice. We always tell you to go ahead and do your own research. Always, always, always do your research before you buy anything, okay? Uh, if you want to come and read about Tribit, if you haven't done so yet, you go to Tribit.io. That's their official website. That's where you're going to have all the information about the project. I personally like them because they are uh, a solution to a problem with the blockchain. I think that's revolutionary in my eyes. So that's why I'm invested on it. Uh, but again, do your own research. This is not financial advice. So this is what we're here for, right? We're for the step-by-steps. Um, uh, I'm assuming that you guys at least have some basic uh, knowledge on uh, cryptocurrency, how to buy it, and things like that. So uh, very first step, of course, we're going to need Ethereum. You're going to have to buy that from exchange. Uh, Coinbase is, is typically the most popular one. Once you purchase Ethereum, we're going to need to send it to a... Uh, digital wallet. Uh, so in my case, uh, you can use MetaMask. Uh, MetaMask is one of the easier ones to use. Uh, this is a Google Chrome extension. So if you don't have MetaMask, uh, you go to google.com, uh, go ahead, type in MetaMask. It's going to give you the option to download it. Once it's downloaded, uh, it's going to appear right here on your right corner. Uh, once you sign in and do all your registration, make sure you do save your uh, your phrase. Uh, that's going to be in case you need to recover your wallet if you lose your password for whatever reason, okay? Put it in a safe place. Uh, next thing you're gonna go, you're gonna go to Uniswap, uniswap.org. Um, right here, you're gonna find the interface where we're gonna connect our wallet to. Once you click on that, next step is gonna be to, find, to connect your wallet. In my case, I already connected, so the first thing you're gonna see whenever you come in here is gonna have uh, what it says connect wallet. Uh, once you click on it, it's just gonna have you sign in on your MetaMask, but this time you already should have sent your Ethereum to your wallet, which is MetaMask. That mine right here shows that it's connected. Once you have that connected, uh, it's gonna show you whatever funds of Ethereum you have at this time and everything. So the first thing is gonna be add the token. This is gonna be the important part because uh, you wanna make sure that we're sending the money to the right place so we get the tokens that we're buying. So when you go to Truebit, all the way to the very bottom, like I said, I'm assuming you read you know, a lot of the stuff here. If you want to read the white paper, be ready to read like 11 pages because it's a lot of information. So when you go to frequently asked questions, this is the important part. How do I obtain the Truebit tokens? And what is the address? This is going to be, this is where you send the money. So that way you can get the tokens and the tokens will show on your specific wallet. So I'm going to copy that. Then if you go to Uniswap, the way to add it, uh, so that once we're connected with your with your digital wallet, you're going to put select token. You're going to put manage right here at the bottom because a, a, a mine, it will show already, but it doesn't do it right off the back. You click on token. You're going to go ahead and paste that information there. And this one comes out. You say mine is as active. In your case, it's going to say import. Um, once you do that, if you click import, it's going to give you a red box. Make sure that you know what you're doing, blah, 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 blah. That's, that's normal. It does it for any type of token, right? Once we do that, all you got to do is you can put how much you want to buy. You can buy a fraction of it. It's not like some stocks that you have to buy a full one. But let's say if you want to buy a full Ethereum, that's about $2,000 worth of it. We're going to select the token. In my case, I already have it here. So let's put true bit. It tells you it's going to be estimated amount of tribute. It's going to be that. Then all you got to do is, right now it's saying I have insufficient balance, but let's say if I was going to buy like 0.5 of it. Oops, I think I need to set more. 0 0.05. See, that's 150, uh, what do you call it, tokens. All you got to do is click swap. That's going to happen. It's going to tell you to confirm the swap. Accept. There's there's so many transactions going on right now, so the price keeps on adjusting. So once you do that, it's going to ask you for confirmation. It's going to tell you what your gas fee, and all you do after that is just click confirm. Then after that, the purchase will be completed. Um, if you want to go see what the action, the reason why I bought this thing, uh, it's been number one on Dex Tools for a while already. If you see the action, this is the current price right now. It's 97 cents. If you see it here, since the 29, it started taking off. And it's just been going, 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 going nonstop. And the amount of transactions is crazy on this thing. You see, most of the transactions are just buy, 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 buy. See? So there you go, guys. That's how you buy. So remember, do your own research. Thank you.